Y'all better not come and try to raid Area 51 or basically Hey y'all, Bucky here. Y'all, I am so excited for today's video. I have painted myself green. I have become an alien. I am jumping on this bandwagon, this whole Area 51 bandwagon. And y'all, I just wanted to jump on here today and talk to y'all about this and just kind of pick your brain. Um, you know, the whole conspiracy theory of aliens, of Area 51, is such a fascinating topic that so many people know about, but like so many people know basically nothing about. So stick around, let's talk about it. Make sure you are subscribed to this channel, y'all, and hit that bell to be notified because I still don't know what my upload schedule is gonna be like. And if you have that bell hit, you'll be notified every time I upload. Hit that thumbs up button, comment down below. And y'all, everything that we're gonna discuss in this video today is all fun, nothing serious. Do not take anything serious in this video because I'm dressed in green and I, but anyways, let's get into this video. Let's go. Well, here's what's trending. Is the government lying about alien <laughs> existence? One million UFO enthusiasts on Facebook say they'll storm Area 51. Nearly a million people say they're going to raid Area 51 in Nevada on September 20th in a quest to see aliens. So they're going to get to the bottom of it. Good for them. So I am here today to talk about this whole Area 51 and this Facebook group that kind of formed basically overnight and literally gained, I mean, right now I think we're over 2 million um, people following this Facebook uh, group and it's called Storm Area 51. They can't stop us all. So y'all, Area 51, I'm sure you know what it is. It's that secretive, you know, little area in Nevada that, you know, we don't really know much about. And conspiracy is, it's full of like aliens, you know, they study aliens there. They, they have UFOs there that they're studying. And that's kind of the conspiracy that's been going around for literally decades. The whole Area 51 thing is just crazy in general. I mean, what is really there? What's is there really aliens? I don't know. Let me know what y'all think. But that's besides, that's besides the point. This Facebook group basically was formed and within four days has 2.4 million people following it. And y'all, this event is supposed to take place Friday, September 20th from 3 a.m. to 6 a.m. So y'all, I think it's hilarious because every news outlet, everybody is like making an, you know, making a story on this. And even the Air Force has came out and said, don't try it because if you try it, we will shoot you basically. And that's just so, that's, it's so crazy to me that like, it's so secretive. And what year? It, it's only been in the past like 10 years that they have actually released documents that have been, you know, classified documents from Area uh, 51 and people have talked about it, which to me is a weird thing. It's been secretive for literally decades. And then all of a sudden within the last so many years, they've released classified documents as the whole like alien conspiracy just keeps getting bigger and bigger. And if it's me, of course I'm going to release documents saying, oh, well, all we're doing is, you know, it's an Air Force base, so we're just testing out planes and, like, you know, like, military stuff, and, like, I'm just, it's just very convenient that they are now, like, releasing these classified documents, and people are coming out that work there saying, oh, no, you know, it's nothing like that. It's just some, like, special military training and blah, blah, blah. Y'all probably know all about it. I'm not here to talk about the conspiracy. I'm just here to talk about this group and just literally how it's just taken, you know, the world by storm. And what are your thoughts about it? Because to me, I think it's kind of exciting. I think it's, like, getting everybody involved in this idea that's been such a secret. People are starting to talk about it more, like what is Area 51? Um, I mean, and honestly, I don't know if I believe the whole aliens thing because, I mean, I just don't know that they're really 
are aliens. At least in the form of like, they're riding on UFOs and coming here. I don't know. I don't know what I believe. There's so many conspiracy theories and y'all, you can get, you can dive deep in the conspiracy theories of Area 51 in the realm of aliens, UFOs, and it's very fascinating. I mean, trust me, ever since like Shane Dawson's theories and stuff, conspiracy theory videos, I have jumped down a dark rabbit hole and just binge watch so many videos like that. But I don't really know what I believe. I do believe that it is something very secretive, which could just be a military, like it's an Air Force base. So obviously they want it secretive. They don't want people around it because you literally could get hurt if they're testing out, you know, let's say a missile or a bomb. If they're testing out these things, they don't want you near it because then they're going to be liable for hurting you. So, I mean, it makes sense that it's so secretive, that it's so cut off. And, but it also makes sense that you see weird UFOs flying around there because if it is an Air Force base, it makes sense that they might be creating some weird planes that don't look like any other planes that you might have seen in the past or not your typical plane. And they're flying it around over there, you know, testing it out. That logically kind of makes sense and why there's UFOs, which is just an unidentified flying object. So not really even have to be alien related. But besides the point, I think it is so cool that this Facebook group started and it's gotten everybody talking about Area 51 again, because unless you're just like hardcore into conspiracy theories, I haven't really heard much about Area 51 in quite a long time. So it'll be interesting how this plays out. Obviously it's all fake. Nobody's really gonna go storm Area 51. And if you do, you're stupid. Please don't, like that's the craziest thing that you could ever do. Like, just don't do it because you will die. I mean, let's be honest. But um, let me know your thoughts on Area 51 on this whole Facebook group that has over 2 million people saying, let's storm uh, Area 51. Let's read the details of this Facebook group. It says, we will all meet up at Area 51 Alien Center Tourist Attraction and coordinate our entry. Okay, so it's just telling everybody where you're going to meet. Interesting. If we Naruto run... Naruto run. If we Naruto run, we can move faster than their bullets. Okay, what does Naruto? Am I saying that right? Okay, I'm going to look really dumb if that's like an easy word and I don't know what that is. Anyways, let's seed them aliens. And there, oh my, there is an official Storm Area 51 website. It is literally just www.stormarea51.us. Something big is coming. Stay tuned for a special announcement. They got merch. Somebody is literally, they, who is profiting off this? For one, they are geniuses. They are selling merch. Let's see how much this shirt is. I clap alien cheeks. What does that even mean? I don't know what that means. I survived Area 51 is another shirt. I saw them aliens. I effing love aliens. I was born on the wrong planet, y'all. This is hilarious. This person is literally a genius and I'm sure so many people are falling for it and buying this merch and I kind of just wish that I would have actually planned this. I mean, recent post. Y'all, there's even pictures of like how they're... What is a Naruto runners? Naruto. What is that? It says this again. They have planned out how they're going to get there. Okay, that is hilarious. Okay, guys, I feel like we need to formulate a game plan. I put together this easy to follow diagram here for a proposed plan. The basic idea is that the Kyles from the front line, if we feed them enough cis uh, and monster energy, they say that anyone in camouflage is their stepdad. Okay, I'm stopping here. I don't know what's happening. Oh, they did put down here, hello US government, this is a joke and I do not actually intend to go ahead with this plan. I just thought it would be funny and get me some thumbsy upsies on the internet. Which worked. This guy, it worked. Your plan worked and you're capitalizing off of it and good for you. I mean, do it. Jackson Barnes, that is his name. He's from Australia. He's not even from America? He lives in Melbourne, Australia? What the heck? Literally, what the heck? Okay, anyways, I know this video was very weird, very different, but I kind of just wanted to make this video to hear your thoughts on Area 51. If you believe the conspiracy theories, if you believe in aliens, I know this is a very, very different video than I've 
ever actually posted, but I'm just curious as to how, like, what people actually think about Area 51. Do you believe the conspiracy theories? <laughs> And did you join this Facebook group? Are you one of those two million that say they're going to storm Area 51? It was a joke, but one the Air Force is taking seriously. A Facebook post, an avowed fake designed to get likes, announced a plan to raid the Air Force base in Nevada, known as Area 51. 